Well, welcome to another episode of Warwick's World. We all know that Warwick likes to look after himself, especially his face. But here is a mental image for you. Are you ready, folks? Warwick Kappa has a new look. In Women's Day magazine. There's the before and there's the after. So how long did the brown hair last? Oh, the brown hair was great. That lasted three days. <laughs> then almost dry reached. Everything else, though. Oh, the teeth touched up, as you can see. They're white anyway. It just gave a bit of uh, three shades lighter. Is absolutely perfect. Just ask Warwick. How many lines ever is there? Fuck the mess, it's good. I almost get a bit of a tweak every two years. And when I'm 70, I get the big threaded facelift. When I pull the skin out, don't tell anyone. Yeah, so he was due for another tweak, and this all came about from having Venus on our very first show, and we got to meet Venus's brother, Dr. Eugene Green, and of course, Warwick hooked up the uh, treatment to come, and as we left his house, I couldn't believe it, there's four toilets in the house, and he still finds himself out in the drain. He got me again. He got me again in the 2,200 grand Mercedes. 220. CLS. 218. Yes, the king of slight exaggerations, as you'll see. Pretty excited. Yeah, mate, I've been looking forward to it for about 10 years, and um, we're going to see the beautiful Eugene. He looks like the beautiful Warwick. Also beautiful is the beautiful uh, Venus, who is his sister, slash brother, which is an attractive lady, slash man. And we're going to get some Botox. Some peels, a little bit of laser. I might get a bit of threading in a couple of years instead of being looking for 54. I look 39. Do you get like scared that. of the needles or nah, what's the process? Nice. It feels nice. I've had acupuncture before and Botox. The process is mate, you, you get some Botox up injection and you just smash it in the forehead. And then four days later, Wombo Wombo Combo, Wizard Kappa, makes history for the youngest, most attractive, one of the best footballers in Australian Aussie Rules history. I was on 38,000 a week, which equates to about 1.7 million back in 1988. And number one song, <laughs> number one porno, number one book, slight exaggeration. Number one mirror. That's, hence, I'm driving a 240,000 CLS Mercedes 217 slash 218. Why do you put a price tag on everything? Because I was in Dad's bags when you were in Baghdad. This is Warwick Kappa coming in live from the Botox office of the beautiful Eugene for the platform. Yes, yeah, so we arrived at the Hood Clinic on St Kilda Road in Melbourne and uh, Warwick's little adventure about to begin. All right, so Warwick, tell me, what are you thinking about for today? Well, I'm 54, I like to look 39, my jumper, which I'm a fair bit of money out of. I like to just wipe off 10 years of Oh, that was your number, was it? Yeah. For Sydney? Oh, yeah, it's important to me in that number. Mm. Hall of Fame, Impressive. number one book, number one movie and hopefully number one facial in the world. <laughs> younger. Just get a few lines up, mate. Just yeah, get a bit smoother. Right. Maybe a little bit of get rid of the crow's feet. Right, no problem. A bit of rejuvenation now. Okay. Come no, back later on. No worries. Uh, a bit of laser, maybe. Yeah, yeah, we can set up a treatment program for you. I'm going to get a little when I'm 58. But they reckon that threading works, so sort of, you go like that. That could be done? Yeah, maybe down the track we'll yeah. think about I'm that. I'm a bit younger than I. Yeah, you're a little bit younger. Yeah, I understand yeah, that, yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and you do, I love you like a brother, but I am pretty sure that. Yeah, okay. <laughs> Alright, so today we're going to probably just focus a little bit on your forehead lines. Yep. Yep. And just a bit on the crow's feet. That's right. And also the, the frown line. Yeah. Okay. So I've done it before. It's starting to come Yeah, through. yeah. So and can you get with the bags a bit or is it more laser? Down the track. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We can't do everything in one day, Warwick. Sorry. Sure, we're going to do it over today. So as Warwick signed all the necessary forms, uh, his procedure was about to begin. Right, so I'm just going to mark out what um, areas we're going to treat today. This bit's not painful. Okay, so okay, so I'm going to get you to go angry. Sure. And I'm more like this, angry. That's it, that's good. Just going to mark hold that position. Okay, great. Yeah, there's heaps here. Exactly. Yeah. Okay, you put your eyebrows up. Look at Jack, hey. That's it. All right, and turn this way. Great, and do a big smile. Yeah, well, this is my, this is my famous face when, when I read people, I'm running magazines. Or, hang on, here we go. Go, mark it. All right, quick, mark it, kid. No worries. LA scene, yeah, real far. We're filming in LA with Schwarzenegger and Pamela Anderson. Big boobs. Close your eyes. Yeah, relax. We're going to start now. 
So we all know Warwick loves the crowd, but we also know that the conversation could pretty much go anywhere. You can actually treat the, the um, anal sphincter area for muscle spasm, what they call an anal fissure. It I've could heard, be used to relax that muscle. I've heard of anal bleaching. No, definitely. And I haven't had a totally different. I have a, I have a triple M mixed movie, but I turn the outside as much as tight as it. No, it relaxes the muscle for people who've got like, what they call a fissure, which is a little oh, part in that area. I've had that. Yeah. So it's a, it can be used for medical I had that. as well. I had um, like a grape hemorrhoid when it do a lot of weights. Ew. Right, yeah, totally. Oh, yeah, that's, yeah, different. Someone that's, that's different. Maybe yeah. get a cut out. <laughs> and I said to the doctor... Probably maybe too much information. The doctor goes, put my finger in. I said, put one hand in, put another one next to it. I don't know. And he goes, I have to do an examination. I said, we got four hours to stop that. Kind of felt good. Anyway, I got rid of the fissure and got rid of the grapes. Right. I put some cotton in and it drops off. True story, that's the blood supply. Yeah. That's right, that's yeah. for banding. Yeah, yeah. yeah. It's, it's totally common, different. It's common in sports today, though. It's common in sports here, back. and it's common in Hall of Famers like myself. All right. <laughs> Do a big smile, Evan. No, 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 big smile, big smile. And relax, relax. Relax? No, no, relax. Uh, no. I know, I hear you. Okay. Ah. Right. Okay, that's it. Really out, okay. Right. Okay. You'll be all right. It's yeah, okay. all right. It's okay. Uh, yeah, all right. You're all right. Oh. Oh. Okay. That's yeah. doing really good. Thanks, mate. Yeah, pretty That's good. It. Yeah, pretty good. Nice. One more here. Yeah, you're one of the better ones. Yeah, good. Ah, relax. It's all right. Have one hand out a little bit. It's all oh, right. It's all right. Yeah. yeah. All right, Warwick. Um, okay, so now it's the painful bit. We're, we're ready for the payment now. Oh. Well, that's something better, better than cash. Yeah, better than cash. Okay. Cash, no cash. The Warwick Cap of Mark of the Century, Hall of Fame. Um, frame picture for the wall. I expect that to be up in about two minutes. And that's worth about $799. <laughs> when I sign it, if you got a pen. Yeah. That'd be worth 950 There you go. So as Warwick signed his payment away, we want to thank Dr. Eugene Green for putting up with him and for being on the platform. And more adventures next week. Thanks for watching. Thank you.